you're going to have ups and downs in life. Things are going to go wrong. You're going to lose businesses. You're going to lose jobs. You're going to break up. And there are times when you get injured and there are times when you get mentally defeated and you feel like you don't want to do it anymore. And those days go on and on and on. When things go wrong, as they sometimes will, when the road you're trudging seems all uphill, when the funds are low and debts are high and you want to smile but have to sigh, when care is pressing you down a bit, Rest if you must, but don't you quit. Life is queer with its twists and turns, as every one of us sometimes learns. And many a failure turns about, when he might have won if he'd stuck it out. Don't give up though the pace seems slow, you might succeed with another blow. Sometimes we have to ask ourselves, what's using my life? One of the things that we know about life is that it is always changing. Sometimes you're up, sometimes you're down. Sometimes things go real well, and sometimes they don't. Sometimes you're happy, and sometimes you're sad. Now that's that thing called life. And when we begin to understand and know that, accepting that reality that that we will never ever have things just on an even kill all the time. That you're gonna have some ups and you're gonna have some downs. But during those down moments, that's where the growth takes place. That's where the work is. Anybody can feel good when they have their health, their bills are paid, they have happy relationships, the children are acting normal. Anybody can be positive then. Anybody can have a larger vision then. Anybody can have faith under those kinds of circumstances. See, but the real challenge, the real challenge of growth, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually, comes when you get knocked down. How you handle it, that's where the growth takes place. What has brought you to this point? What did you learn from it? Are you learning anything? Or are you doing it over and over and over again? Are you going through it or are you growing through it? Are you bigger and better because of it? Things are going to happen to you. And the most important thing to do is to harness your will and let it go. I'm in control here. I'm not going to let this get me down. I'm not going to let this destroy me. I'm coming back and I'll be stronger and better because of it. You have got to make a declaration that this is what you stand for. You're standing up for your dreams. You're standing up for peace of mind. You're standing up for health. You want it and you're going to go all out to have it. Yes, I'm going to turn this situation around. I'm not going to sit back and, and moan and cry over what happened and what went wrong and who did what. I'm going to do something about this situation. Expect things to get better for you because they are. See, life is cyclic. Whatever experience you're having right now, it has not come to stay. It has come to pass. We all go through pain, get a reward for yours. There's some things in life you don't need no degree for, you don't need no money for, you don't need no support for. There's something in life you just gonna get through when you tell yourself, I'm gonna get through this. I need you to look at that sickness that's going on in your life right now, whatever it is. I want you to say, I can not beat it. I can not beat it, I will beat it, I must. You think it's gonna be easy, forget about it. All right, don't even try to be successful, it's a wrap. It's not going to be easy, but I want you to feel that pain going through your body. And as pain leaves your body, guess what's going to take its place? Success. And when that thing tells you to quit, you look at it in his eye and say, I ain't going nowhere. I will break you before you break me. You will not defeat me. You will not destroy me. 
I'm unbreakable now. Life is going to see how bad you want what you say you want. Impose your will on it. Life will give in to you if it knows you're serious about whatever it is that you're trying to do. Life will give in to you. Whenever you start, you make sure you finish. If you do not kill me, you will not stop my drive. No petty adversity will not stop me. I have to complete every mission that I set out on. From this day forward, set out to achieve greatness, not by looking for someone to give it to you, but by going through all of the blood, all of the sweat, all of the hard work, by going to work to set your own inner greatness free. I believe in you, because I know it's there. No matter what anyone else has said, or how anyone else has made you feel before, it's there. So you had it harder than other people, well then you're gonna have to work a little harder. But trust me when I say, you have greatness inside you. Wherever we are, with whatever hand that life has dealt us, we have the freedom of spirit. We can go through life whining and weeping, or we can have the kind of spirit that regardless of what happens to you, you can stand up inside of yourself. You have an uncomfortable soul. It can be painful, it will be uncomfortable, and that's where the growth is. When you're stretching out, when you're taking life by the collar, you're gonna get thrown to the ground again and again and again. But when you have determination, and you know that what you're doing is right, it gives you your life, it gives a special meaning and power to you, you begin to discover some things about you that you don't know you've got when you put yourself in that type of challenging situation.